Hi there, Adela here from Podcast Brunch Club. So in this episode of the PBC podcast, I sat down with Willow Belden, host and creator of the Out There podcast. We featured her episode entitled Better Than Fun on our podcast listening list on the theme of Wanderlust. You can find the list at podcastbrunchclub.com slash wanderlust. I hope you enjoy our conversation. Thanks so much, Willow, for joining me on the Podcast Brunch Club podcast. I'm happy to have you. Yeah, thanks for inviting me. Of course. Why don't we start by you telling me a little bit more about how you started the podcast and a little bit about yourself? Yeah, so I started the podcast in 2015, and I had been a reporter and host at Wyoming Public Radio, which is the NPR station in Wyoming. And I'd been there for several years, and I really liked it. It was a good a good job. It was I felt like I was doing meaningful work. I really liked my colleagues there. But I didn't love it enough somehow. It always felt like something was missing. Like I would talk to other people who would get up in the morning and just be so excited to go do whatever they were doing. And I didn't quite have that. It always felt like kind of stressful. Um Mm -hmm. And so, yeah, so I had this idea that, okay, there's got to be mo like, there's got to be a way to I wanted to get to that point where, where you just wake up in the morning and jump out of bed. And you're like, yes, I'm so excited to go do this thing that I'm doing. But I didn't know what that thing was going to be. You know, people, people kept saying, well, if you want to do something else, like, what do you want to do instead? And I was like, well, I don't know if I knew that I would already be doing it probably. Right. <laughs> you know? right. <laughs> um, and so, so then I just, after a while, I finally decided, you know what, I just need some space to clear my mind. I, like, I'm not going to figure this out while I'm at this job. So I'm going to quit and take some time for myself and decided to go hiking for the summer. And I hiked a 500 mile trail through Colorado. Well, oh, my gosh. It yeah, it was sort of it was sort of crazy. It's called the Colorado Trail and it goes from Denver to Durango. So it's like, you know, through the through the mountains, through the wilderness. And I wasn't really a backpacker at that point, but I had read Wild by Cheryl Strayed, just like everyone yes. else. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I was like, Oh, I wanna do that. Maybe that will help me figure out my life. <laughs> and um, <laughs> so I like read a lot of books and did a lot of research and figured it out. And so anyway, so so long story short, I went and did this and um I guess in my mind, I was going to like walk around, walk along this trail, like thinking deep thoughts. And at some point, the clouds were going to part and I was going to figure out what I wanted to do. Um, Just like and, it happens in the books, right? Right. But movies. that didn't, <laughs> right. And of course, that didn't really happen like that. Right. Um, <laughs> you know, at the end, like, I don't think I actually thought any deep thoughts along the trail. It was mostly like me thinking about like, oh, the blisters on my feet hurt or like, this is a really pretty view or, you know, I'm hungry or whatever. But like, <laughs> um, so after I finished the trail, a few a few days later, I was, you know, back at my house and I was listening to NPR and I remember thinking, like, I don't, I don't, I don't want to go back to reporting news, but I mm -hmm. do still want to keep telling stories through sound. I think it's a really effective way to, to get really personal and get real people to really relate to what you're talking about. So I knew I wanted to do that. And I, and I said, you know, I really want to go deeper though. I want to, I want to be, I want to get into the personal stories and I want to get into the bigger questions that personal stories can uncover and can tackle. I had sort of had an idea for a while that I was in, that I might want to do an outdoor podcast of some sort, but I didn't have time to really pursue that while I had a full-time job and I also wasn't quite sure, like, sort of what the focus would be. But now I had nothing but time because I, you know, I quit job, my job. Right. <laughs> exactly. And so, so I kind of started, started dreaming this up because I, it, for me, hiking the Colorado Trail had been a very healing process and it had been a, a process that sort of like, made me think a lot about myself and the world and society and all these things. And I thought, okay, you know, often experiences outdoors can do that for us. Often experiences in the outdoors can like bring us to sort of bigger realizations about how the world works and how our lives work. Mm -hmm. And I wanted to share that with. 